your guys battled tonight, uh, Mike, and, and got the reward you'd finally like to see, and maybe they've deserved earlier. Well, I would say, you know, we didn't have a very good second period. We had a good first, and I thought we had a good third. We didn't have a very good second. They took it to us big time in the second period, and our goaltending was outstanding. Uh, you know, he might like to have the one back from the side, but in saying that, uh, he found a way to give us an opportunity. Uh, especially the teams were good, and in the end, we stuck with it and found a way to get a win. So good for us, and we needed the point. But more important than the points, we needed the confidence. And so suddenly, I think we got points in four to five games, and uh, you start to feel more like a hockey team. And, and confidence is everything in life. You got to earn your coach can't give it to you, the media can't give it to you, your parents can't give it to you. You got to earn it. And so this is part of that process. Speaking of confidence, can you see James's confidence? Gaining with each start? Well, I sure think so. He's suddenly soft. The puck doesn't bounce all over the rink. He just hits him and he sticks and he controls the rebound. So I think he's doing a real good job. And, you know, what I like is in life, when someone gives you an opportunity, you do something with it, and you grab it, and you hang on to it as hard as you can. And we're all put here to maximize our abilities, and that's what he's been doing. See Jake starting to get his legs under him after coming back from the injury a little bit more. Well, obviously, uh, the first little bit back, he had played so well, and then he first got back and he struggled a little bit, and so, you know, it's just confidence. Uh, I didn't think he was good in the first, but I thought he got going after that. And you know, it's anytime uh, you're a young guy, you get a couple points, and you get feeling a little good about yourself. I think that's a positive thing for our team. Is the play Riley makes on the game tying goal just an instinct thing that? Over for well, him. I have a rule that the, when the D's below the goal line, you're not allowed to pass it out front. So he just, it's a good thing he scored. <laughs> <laughs> how, about, how about Peter tonight getting back in the lineup and, and producing for your Well, right I away? thought he did a good job. And, uh, you know, the, the interesting thing about life is if you just have mental resolve and you stick with it and you believe in yourself, it's amazing what can happen. So good for him and good for us. And we're trying to catch everyone doing it right. Uh, the more good players we have, the better off we are. He has a chance to be a good player if he's competitive and he's dialed in every night. And if he's not, he has no chance. So uh, the most competitive guys end up playing. How uh, confidence games against the best team in the Western Conference right now? Does that well, even add to that? Well, I think the good thing about it is obviously we knew they were going to push. We'd beat them. And, and they could say, OK, they weren't prepared for us. Game over. They're prepared here today. And so. You know, I thought we started good, and I thought we finished good in, in the second period. Obviously, we got ourselves in trouble. You know, uh, you hate to be in the last minute of the second period. We're in a great situation in the offensive zone, suddenly it's in our net. So those are things we got to get better at. But uh, it's a good feeling for our guys today. They should enjoy it, and let's get ready for Nashville. I think they got a quick seven tonight, so we better be ready. <laughs>